You still pregnant. Am I single? My name is Jayla. It's another day with Shady J, period. Today, I have a get to know me slash question and answer video for you guys. So, um, I put this on my Instagram and I put this on my Snapchat, like the, the little YOLO app. And some of y'all, I said get juicy, but some of y'all was saying some weird stuff, like. Mm-mm. It wasn't it. But I got my little tabby tab right here. Oh my mama tabby tab. Don't tell her. Don't tell her. The LG baby. And we just finna get into this video. How are you coping with everything going on? Whoever asked that question, that's so nice. Cause like you really care about me to ask that? <laughs> if you watching this, I love you. But anyways, um, I'm really coping with everything well. I mean, I feel like I did need a break from school anyways because stuff started to get very overwhelming. And when I get overwhelmed, it's not good. Like, I be falling apart and stuff. It's just not good. So I feel like I needed a break. I needed that break anyways. But, um... As far as staying in the house, I mean, it hasn't been that bad because I don't just stay in the house. Like, I go to the store. I guess I'm doing great. I feel like during this quarantine, like, my mindset has changed. Like, I've always had a mature mindset, but now it's like I really, I'm really getting into the mature thing and... I'm thinking more about my future and planning stuff out, trying to get everything settled or whatever, because I got some stuff. I got some stuff up my sleeve, okay? Okay. But yeah, but as far as that, I am doing great, fantastic, magnificent. Okay. So what is one of your biggest pet peeves? Uh, I have a lot of pet peeves. I probably can't think of them all right now because I'm kind of like on the spot. But one of my biggest pet peeves is a liar or people lying. I hate when people lie. Like, y'all, I go crazy. Like, I be so mad because, like, why you got a lot of me? Like, I'm not Jesus. I'm not going to send you to heaven or hell. So, like, why you got to lie to me? And especially when it be about the little things. Because I feel like if you can lie about something little, you can lie about something big. Like, don't lie to me. Do not lie to me. Do I wear makeup every day? No, I don't wear makeup at all. I do want to learn. Like, I've been wanting to learn makeup, but I just... I can't see myself spending my money buying all that. I just can't. Maybe when I get, um, maybe when I start working, I'll start buying makeup because I have more money. But uh, right now, I, I just, I can't do it. What is your pet's name? My pet's name is Bear, he is a dog. I don't even know what kind of dog he is, but uh, I, I looked on this little app, a dog scanner, and it told me that it was a, a, a Russian Bohegian. I don't even know. I might put it up there. I don't know. But yeah, his name is Bear. I did have a dog named Binky, but he ran away. <laughs> R.I.P. Wait. Is he dead? I don't even know if he dead, y'all. I really think somebody down the street from me got my dog. For real. I don't think my dog did. 
How old are you? I am 17 years old. I just turned 17, May 4th. Taurus gang, curious. You trade cousin, ain't it? Uh, if me and you talking about the same trade, then yes, I am Trey's cousin. Would you date your best friend? Um, I would. I really would. Because I feel like but at the same time, I don't know. Because, like, if y'all got this close bond and y'all so close, like, unbreakable, and then y'all start dating and stuff start getting real serious and then both of y'all start getting jealous and then you start arguing and y'all end up breaking up and that, like, ruin a friendship. I don't know. It depends. Like, if we literally, like, best friends, never been nothing more than that, then um, I don't think I would because I wouldn't want to ruin that friendship. But if we always been, like, slick, you know, flirting on the low, then I might. But I have had a past experience with that, and that just turned out horrible. So I, I don't know. I probably wouldn't date my best friend. Because it'd be so, y'all, it'd be so sad, like... You be this, and then one moment you be like this, and then it's like you, you ain't got no boo and no friend. Like, what is you supposed to do? Anyways, do you believe in love at first sight? Uh, no, I don't. When well, folks be like, when I first saw that person, I knew that she was the one. I knew he was the one. Girl, shut up, boy, shut up. No, you didn't. I don't believe in that. I mean. <laughs> If y'all do, to each is your own, but uh, no. I feel like I really gotta get to know somebody because I'm not even the type of person to fall, fall for somebody fastly. Like, it take me a while. But um, no, I can't just look at you and be like, oh my gosh, I love you. I wanna be with you for the rest of my life. No. Have you ever cheated? Y'all not gonna believe this, but I have. But it was like in middle school, like in sixth grade when I wasn't even supposed to have a boyfriend. But basically, um, I was with this dude. First of all, I was really peer pressure into being with this dude. Cause you know, like, you know when you really don't like somebody, but then everybody like, oh my God, y'all would be cute. Like y'all should go together. That kind of like made me like this dude. So I ended up going with him. We was not together that long. And went to a basketball game. <laughs> And some of it, y'all know this was these kick days. So I had asked to see his phone or something. Like, I wanted to take a picture. I don't even know what I was asking his phone for. But basically, he would not give me his phone. And I'm like, if you not cheating, why you can't give me your phone? Like, I don't care. I be jumping to conclusions. Like, that was just, no, that was not it. But, um, yeah, so then he gonna walk away and go with his little friends or whatever and come back and let me see the phone. Y'all, I went on kick. Kid you not, it was one message. One kick conversation. And I was like, oh, no. Oh, no, I'm not going for none of that. I'm not going for none of that. So then, I don't know how long after that we was together. I don't know, but... We used to go to these lock-ins at the skating rink. And it was this boy that really, 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 really liked me. Like, he been at me for a while now, but I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't. I would cool on him right then and then. So, basically, we went to the lock-in, y'all. It was Valentine's Day, too. It was Valentine's Day. And then we end up, like... Lincoln or whatever. He had bought me a little slushy, y'all. Like, okay, okay. Cause the other one didn't even come to the lock in. He didn't give me enough for Valentine's Day. Talking about some I quote y'all. He gotta save up for his Hawaii trip. So I was like, um, no. <laughs> no. So after that, after that weekend when we went back to school, I ended up breaking up with him. And it was so bad, y'all. We was in a bus on the zone. I looked at him and I was like, I mean, and then he knew from there. <laughs> oh my God, y'all. That's funny. Am I single? 
No, y'all, I am not single. I know y'all been being nosy, but let me break this down to y'all. I am not single. I haven't been single in almost a year. Me and my boyfriend have not broken up. But a lot of y'all been wondering and asking because we used to have each other on our Instagram pages and in our bios. But I'm going to just say this. Every relationship has their trials and tribulations. And my girls know what I mean when I'm saying, you know, you get mad and be like, well, I'm finna take him out of my bio. And then he be like, well, I'm finna take him out of my bio. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. And then we haven't been posting each other lately. And that's really because um, we're really just working on ourselves. Like, everything don't got to be posted. Just because he not posting me don't mean I'm not hurt. Okay, but I've been here, and he been here, so we are still together. So stop trying to be nosy. I mean, shoot, I'll be trying to be nosy too, but anyways, a lot of people been wondering, so I just had to get that out there. Somebody said, you still pregnant. Cause baby, y'all trying to be funny at this point. Cause uh uh, I'm not. I am not still pregnant. I've never been pregnant, honey. I ain't having no kids at well in like the far, far, far future. You know what I'm saying? Like when I got a ring on this thing, and I'm married, not engaged, baby, married. Okay, and my business is in order. Okay, don't play with me. What do you want to be when you grow up? Um, I want to be an entrepreneur. Y'all, I have want I have wanted to be an entrepreneur for forever. Like I just cannot see myself doing nothing else. Like I like stuff my way. I want to go to work when I want to go to work. I don't want to have to clock in for nobody. I just want my own and I'm going to get it. I ain't going to go into detail about what I'm what I'm going to do. But stay tuned, baby. Y'all finna see me on TV. Um, Quality you look in a partner. I like somebody very dependable. Like if I can't depend on you, who can I depend on? You supposed to be my boo. I need you to be there when I need you to be there. Very dependable. Somebody that I can trust. Like, I don't want nobody going out to learn my business and stuff. Somebody that makes me feel secure. Um, somebody that got business by themselves. Like, they know what they want to do in the future. They not sitting around being a bum. Like, they have something going whatsoever. Um... And that's really, that's really it. I mean, they got to be a little bit of cute. <laughs> How did you and your boyfriend meet? We actually met off Instagram, y'all. Yeah, because you know your girl. Your girl be looking cute. I might have a story time about that because it's more than just meeting off Instagram. It's like a way. It's kind of cool, but... I don't know if I'm gonna do a story time or not. I think I should. Yeah, I'm gonna do a story time. But basically, we met off Instagram. You know, your girl was looking cute. He slid in my DM, period. <laughs> That's it. That's all. Are you a shopaholic? <laughs> I am definitely a shopaholic. Y'all know that try on haul that y'all just watched in my last video? Because I know y'all watched my last video. And I said I was done shopping. Baby, I'm ready to shop again. <laughs> I'm about to order me some more stuff. It's really like I have a problem, but I mean, it's not that bad, but it's really bad. Like, yes, I am a hop shopaholic. I love shopping. Like, do you F on YouTube? I don't even know what that means, but um, no. 
That's weird. Anyways, short guy or tall guy, I definitely would prefer a tall guy because, uh, well, I do have a boyfriend and he is tall. But um, I don't really like short dudes. No offense to any short dudes, but uh, even though I'm really short, like I'm really, really, really short, my height is 5'2". So I'm really short, it's just, I don't no, short dudes not, not like they don't seem built for me the perfect job or the perfect relationship <sighs> I say perfect job yeah I say perfect job because I just feel like perfect relationship I don't know that sound too, too something. Like, you know how you can't be with that soft dude because he too soft and it's just always romantic and always, no, I don't want that. Yeah, perfect job. Cause then I'll be stress-free from job. I love going to work, you know what I'm saying? Let me take you on a date, all jokes aside. I really think Sequest put this question on here because I think he did. So if he did, I mean, yes, of course. But if he didn't, um, no, I have a boyfriend. That completes this video. I hope you guys enjoy my get to know me slash Q and A. So if you feeling the vibe, subscribe, comment positive feedback and tell me what videos y'all want me to do or what videos y'all like the most and Run this video up with likes. I will see y'all in the next video. Peace.